Hello everybody, I am Pixie Dust Summer and welcome back to my channel. So, in this video we are going to be doing the third episode of, um, this family's current on hold. Yeah? Yeah. Um, but anyways, so in this, um, in the last episode, they had just gotten out of university and... They were, you know, beginning their lives together, wanting to travel, and all that good stuff. So, um, without further ado, I'm gonna go ahead and jump right in to this. So, oops, <laughs> I'm all over the place. Oh my goodness. Okay, so real quickly, I'm gonna do a little house tour updated. So, back here, we have a little basketball court um, that I downloaded from the store, and then a pool back here and a little laundry thingy. Oopsies. I forgot to delete this. Oh my god. This is from when I was testing out um, the greenhouse thingy. But none of my sims have the gardening skills so I don't need it. And we don't have enough room. And then we have some um, kung fu martial arts crap right there. And then... Um, the kitchen is basically the same, except we have the bigger station and the wood fire oven. We have our bird over here. Um, the living room is exactly the same. We have a little swing. Um, over here we have two incense thingies. Um, this little thing is from Egypt, I believe. And then this, um, dollhouse. And then her easel. The bathroom you guys have seen. In the garage we have some wine. We have a fortune cookie thingy. And we have a wine maker, nectar, whatever. Please, we all know it's wine. <laughs> and then upstairs, the room is exactly the same. We have the little dog's area, a nursery, and then their child's bedroom. So, I'm going to jump right into these sims. So, let me get them over here. They haven't had any makeovers. Um, because... You know, why would I do that? <laughs> um, okay. So, you guys met Penny Randall, or Penny Carter at the time, but this is Penny, you know, she was, um, just out of college and, you know, got her degree and all that good stuff, and she was level four in the, um, what's it called? Oh my god. Education career, yeah. So, she, I already went over her things, but I'll do it again. She's ambitious, which she got from university. She's disciplined, genius, artistic, friendly, and a born saleswoman. She likes Irish green cookies and hip-hop music, and she actually ages up today. And I'll give her a makeover. She's a Libra, and she wants to reach max visa levels for all three destinations, which I can tell you is not going to happen. <laughs> Definitely not. Um... She is the level 10 district superintendent of education career. She got super far in that. Somehow she did between all the traveling they did. She worked, you know, sometimes and then they had kids. So she has quite a few skills. She's a level 2 athlete, level 8 charisma, level 7 cooking, level 1 handiness, level 9 logic, level 3 painting, level 5 social networking, level 1 photography, and a level 3 in nectar making. So yeah, she is very, very, very skilled. Um, she has a lot of stuff in her inventory from, like, vacations. She reads a lot of books as well. Um, she has a ton of points. Um, we have a, t a lot of money because our dog actually hunts a lot, and which I talked about in part 2 of... Did I talk about it? No. I don't know, I talked about it in Generations, but anyways, um, yeah, he found a bunch of gems, and then we also found a whole bunch of stuff, you know, going through, uh, tunnels and caves and traveling and all that stuff, so, um, they've actually been to each destination, China, France, and Egypt, and they got engaged in France, and married in China, so I'm gonna put those pictures, all the pictures I have of them, in the slides, uh, uh, in the <laughs> end of the video. I'll put it in a slideshow, um, so you guys can see all that cute stuff. So, 
yeah and then let's jump over to her husband oh my god what are you wearing you know what i'm gonna do it this way because i don't want him to stop what he's doing um so you guys have seen his outfit before but this is richard randall oh my goodness her husband he looks exactly the same um he is super cute he came with university life they are so cute together um they're both like super travely i have like i want them to travel with their children so i think once their son ages up we'll start going on vacations and stuff he's a level six in the business career um level he is adventurous family oriented snob grumpy and lucky he ages up in two days but i'm gonna age him up today that way they have the same like thing um, he likes sea foam, cobbler, electronic music, and he's an Aries. He wants to be level 10 of the CEO, business career. So like I said, he's level 6. He's doing pretty good. He has a degree in business as well as Penny. He is a level 5 athlete, level 3 handiness, level 3 social networking, and level 7 in martial arts. He loves his martial arts, guys. 24-7. Also has a ton of things. He actually... I downloaded this mod and I in no way um, encouraged this. I just thought it would add a little bit of like drama, not drama, but like depth into this game. He has a smoking problem, smoking habit. The Sim has developed a smoking habit. It would be wise to keep some cigarettes around to keep stress levels down. So every once in a while, after you like smoke a couple cigarettes, he get, they get that. And then every once in a while, his fun will go all the way down. He'll be super stressed and he'll say he needs a cigarette. So, I plan, this is his first box, his first pack, so he has six left, so I plan on after he smokes those six that we're gonna try to break the habit. It takes 15 days to break the habit, so, um, yeah, that's just a little thing. He kind of developed it in, um, when he was in Egypt, he met a guy and, you know, they had some fun, and then all of a sudden, you know, snap of his fingers, he was addicted, so... Yeah, that is Richard Randall. He's a good guy regardless, though, you know, just because you smoke cigarettes doesn't make you a bad person. So then they have their first child. Come over here. No, we're not doing that. And I'm gonna have her change into her everyday wear. So this is their firstborn. They're still really young. They're almost adults, or they are, are going to be adults. The reason they're so young is because they traveled a lot in, like, university, so they didn't age up those days. But here is their child, Olivia Randall. She is so cute. I love her. She has her mom's hair and eyes. She's a virtuoso, inappropriate, and heavy sleeper. I randomized all her traits. She likes gray, key lime pie, and country music, and she's a Virgo. She aged up in five days into a teenager. Um, she hasn't really gone to school yet, so. She's level one in logic and a level two in writing. She got that when she was a toddler from her little, like, playpen. So that's really cool. Did you finish? Yeah, she did. So yeah, that's Olivia. She's a lot like her parents. She's more like her dad, though, because, like, she's really shy. And, um, but she's also really adventurous. And she hears about all the stories and things from when they went on their travel so she's very excited to start going with them and exploring new places you know so yeah i'm excited to do that and then oh yeah and she has like a bunch of instruments because i plan on her being like super super um musical music musically inclined yeah, there we go so then this is their new baby he's aging up tomorrow i think um this is their son richard jr um he is so cute i've never done like the junior thing but i thought it'd be really cute so richard and richard um he's disciplined and athletic he likes island life it's too surprised in white and he is a pisces um obviously not much to him he ages up in one day i might actually age him up today that way i can just create a sim all of them one time so yeah this is richard jr he's so cute um, I'm very excited for him to age up. I think we're done having kids, because obviously we're out of space. Um, I think two kids is perfect, and then they can travel a whole bunch, and all that good stuff, so, 
yeah, that is basically the household I've been playing with, or the updated version of it. Oh yeah, I forgot to show you their dog. Duh! And by the way, this is their bird, Jules. Or Jewel, she learned, she, uh, <laughs> she can talk, say greetings and happy stuff. And this is the fish that um, Penny's had since university, Waylon. So let me show you their doggy. I love this dog to death. He's so cute. So this, or she's so cute. This is their dog, Chloe. We adopted her from the shelter and she came with her name. She is so cute and adorable. I love her so much. She is not destructive, adventurous, and independent. And she is up in three days to an elder, which is insane. She is a level six in hunting. She has a bunch of stuff, and she actually went on all of our vacations with us. We took her on every single one. She was like our best companion. We took her to all the caves, and she explored so much. I don't know if she has it in her scrapbooks, but no, she doesn't. But yeah, she went to all the places that they went to, and it's so cute. We'll obviously take her along with us when the fam goes, but yeah. That is it for this video. Um, I was gonna film Generation today, but um, I redid like all my furniture today, and I moved a bunch of stuff around. That I'm really tired. And I don't feel like reloading up that game because my computer is just not cooperating today. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is the third current household of this Randall family. Um, originally Carter, obviously. Um. But yeah, I hope you guys liked it. Give it a thumbs up if you did, and make sure that you comment down below what you guys would like to see in my future videos, and subscribe to my channel if you don't want to miss out on my next video. I think tomorrow I'm posting Generations. Um, I think starting Monday or Sunday I'm going to start my schedule, and I'll tell you guys about that tomorrow probably. Um, I just need to finalize some stuff, but anyways... Yeah, I hope you all have a super duper duper fantastic day, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, guys! What I would do is take away this fear of being loved, allegiance to the pain. Now I'm fucked up, and I'm missing you. I'll never be like you. I would give in if things change. This fickle minded heart. Fake shiny things Now I'm fucked up And I'm missing you